Mahal and I are going to unbox a boxy charm. So I get boxy charm every month now, and I've had it for like seven months, something like that. And I really love boxy charm, and I thought it would be so fun if instead of just me unboxing it, we would both unbox it. And since I'm already wearing makeup, I'm gonna try some of this makeup on Mahala. You might have to go grab some. Okay, so I'm opening the box with my keys. Okay, that was good. All right, so you open it up. It says, hello, Charmers. So beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna try and, oh, okay, I haven't looked at this box yet, so stuff falls out. Ooh, <laughs> yes. Okay, I, I haven't even looked what's in. Okay, so first you have a little pamphlet. Ooh, with some offers on the back. Got some coupons back here you can screenshot. And then it's like a pamphlet. So the theme of this month is eye candy. Ooh, I love candy. I wish there was candy in there. <laughs> that would make me so happy. We should, oh, what? Ooh, I'm already excited. Ooh, I'm already excited. I see a ColourPop palette. And you're like, how do you know it's a club up? I'm just uh, <laughs> I love makeup. Mm, we got a liquid lipstick. Okay, should we start with that? Actually, no. Okay, so first product is a pores no more vacuum clean vacuum cleaner pore purifying mask purifying. Oops. Well, I can't. What a title. I can't do. I can't. We can't do this because, well, I literally have makeup on and I have to go to work. But this is what the product looks like. So that's the this cleanser, and I'm gonna smell it. I love Dr. Brand products. Obviously, it has a seal. So. Oh, the <laughs> smell this. It smells like it smells like foyer. Oh, Dang. It smells like sewage. It smells like a heart. That smells terrible. And you're supposed to put that on your feet. It smells a little better when it's in there. It's blue. Look at it. It's kind of blue. <laughs> so, okay, I have a feeling I want to see the value of this because I have a feeling this is really expensive. Because Dr. Brandt products yeah, are super good. expensive. So the box was $21. Oh my god, I almost saw the rest. Okay, let's go over the price because I want to still surprise myself a little bit. <laughs> okay, so then we have this high definition liquid lipstick. Guess who's gonna try this? Okay, well, I need my keys again. Did that do it? Nope, I'm just gonna rip the box. Okay, I'm ripping the box. <gasps> oh my god, I saw the palette! <laughs> okay, don't look at the palette. I'm just closing the box. Okay, so, color lipstick. I hope Mahalo likes this. Whoa, what color is it? I don't know. Okay, the color is, before we look at it, color, I guess it says it, it's gonna say it on the Ooh! Okay, this is not gonna look good on you. <laughs> not at all. Okay, well. It'll look great on you, though. It's gonna look good on me. So what it looks like on camera it's it looks a little like more brick color than pink um what color but what what is the name of this color there's no name on on here okay not even a number no 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 way like maybe 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 oh maybe i ripped it from the, the top deeply Okay. Okay, well, you have to try it. Not putting that on me. I'm putting a little bit on it. Let's smell it. Ooh, this smells like candy. 
Aha, see why you call it candy? Because <laughs> we're Okay, here. We're gonna put a little bit on. Okay, I'm gonna take a look. Look at she is not amused. <laughs> Go. Like this. Ooh, it's Okay, but it's not. Okay, rub them together. You're gonna like it. Don't look at yourself yet. Okay, but like, I don't know if it's like a drying formula, but it's not really a formula. Okay, look it up. Swish it around a little bit. It, is it drying? It looks really sticky. It's sticky. Mm, that's a dry. But look at yourself. Oh. That is not what you look like in real life. Look at me. Oh. That is not what you look like in real life. Look at me. No, look at me. It doesn't look that bad. As like the camera makes it look hideous. Okay, yeah, look at yourself. One moment. I uh, trust me. I would have told you if you looked bad. Okay. See, it's not mm. that bad. See, if it was applied evenly, the color would look good. It almost could have passed as like that. You like it though, like it just doesn't look bad on you. What do you think? With a nice lip liner, like a darker lip liner? No, that's true. I think that would look it really look, good. It looks terrible. It does look terrible. And it does, it, it, even still here, it looks lighter than it really does. It's more peachy. But I do mm -hmm. see how this would look better on my skin tone. It has more of a brick undertone than I thought. Well, I haven't. Ooh, we got a brow gel and a highlighter. Okay, I cannot take this off. Mm. I'll worry. I'll be back. Ugh. What do we think of today's lipstick? Cute. Oh, the sun finally came out. What a blessing. I am so excited for the next three things. Mahala could just hurry up. I, I have a Jeez. feeling this is gonna be a monthly favorite, even though it smells bad. Because every single one of this product, I love. Um, I have the cleanser, I really love, and the primer, so good. I'm actually wearing it today. Oh, the next thing we can, the next thing we can put on our brows, and I can put it too, because like, it wasn't even more brow stuff, even though I already do more brows. <laughs> so we like the thing brows. <laughs> All right, so this is a brow gel by the Brow Gal. This is the kind of brow gel that apparently has fibers. Fibers? It says tinted brow gel with microfibers. So if you don't have fibers. It's kind of like those like my I'm scared that yeah. have the fibers. But I, but I think, I've never tried actually a brow product with fibers because I think it would just look awful. I just hope this color is dark enough. Okay, mm -hmm. okay this color is brown hair. Thank God, because <laughs> I watched Kathleen Light's video this morning mm -hmm. and she had got the color like taupe or something and it was it was basically blonde and oh, it just <laughs> it, it didn't match. So I'm gonna try on your brows and I'm not gonna do it on mine because I don't want them to alter my color. Oh that's true. And what the this is so freaking light. Uh, brown hair, what? This is not but okay, this, blonde. This is light brown. Alright, so you see, okay, it looks a little darker on camera. If not dark. It smells like regular things. Okay, we're gonna try this on. Ooh, I like it. Surprisingly, I like it. But I don't think there's a lot of product coming out. I feel like you're gonna run out of this really fast because it's not as pretty. Mahala has thick brows. Great. Right. That's what my mom says about my hair. She goes, You're lucky. You're lucky you have a lot of hair. <laughs> okay, look at yourself. Do you see a difference? Open I think my camera. You just need a brow black like Oh, gosh. No, it's not that bad. Okay. I thought it was going to be way better. Isn't that They're terrible? Cute? Don't you? I think it matches perfectly, actually, because if they were the actual color of your brows, your brows would be the kind of annoying that, like, you know what I mean? I think it is. Let me see. Yeah, 
I really like it. I mean, yeah, I think like you just need to shape your brows. Oh here, yeah, then... my eyebrows need some work. What do we think? I think it looks really good for Momo. Yeah, come, go, go closer. Okay. Ugh. Do one of those like beauty moments where you close your eyes. Oh my god. I really like that. You gotta come closer. Yeah, they look really good. So this brow gel, I'm impressed. I, I can't wait to try this on my brows. I think it's gonna look good. Um, Cause it is not like, it's not like light on your brows, but I think it's like lighter so it gives you the more natural effect. Oh, but I actually. really like it. Yeah, so much. It made a huge difference actually. Mm -hmm. You need a brow gel. Okay. A brow wax. Oh my god. This is gonna be really interesting. So this is the Atart highlighter. Oh, your favorite. Highlighters and um, eyeshadows and lipstick. Oh, not everything. <laughs> uh, but honestly, eyeshadows, um, I mean, highlighters are definitely my best, my favorite category for like, um, for makeup. So this is gonna be, okay, this is, I'm gonna put some on your skin, but I'm gonna put some on mine because I feel like this is actually might just be too pale for you. It like, looks flat, too pale. Flat out. This is the color Sparkler. This is what it, the, the packaging is cute. You see that? Cute. Go low. Okay. I'm trying to see like if it's something that you can apply on the eyes. I'm gonna put it on the eyes for you. So it just says it just says liquid highlighter, so you can use it. I mean, I'm not putting it like in your. Okay, this is a very interesting application. I thought it was. It looks like your eye primer. Exactly. That, that's why I think you probably can put it on the eyes. So I'm gonna. Ooh. Oh, I just watch it. I think it's actually. This is kind of gold. I think that one might look too terrible. Now if it's blended out, see? It oh, yeah. has, like more it, rose gold. Right, because on you, like uh, the gold looks so good. Like pink. Yeah, if this was brown. <laughs> like, it was like, yeah, yeah, like pink. Okay, so I'm gonna show you a nice swatch of it. You guys can't really tell how like shiny it is. Okay, so I'm gonna put some on your eyes and I think this is gonna look really good. Oh yeah, this is, okay, I barely tapped it on, and I think... I need to like, transfer it from one hand to the other, because <laughs> I can't apply it with my left hand. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh, cute, okay. Oh, but it, it is a little... Okay, I don't know if I like it, actually. Oh, really? Well, it's a little bit... I want to even it out and put it on the other side. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna dry my skin because of what I just discovered. Oh. <laughs> um, when you sheer it out, as you would on your face, it has a like glittery mm. kind of like it's too glittery, and I think that I'm not gonna like that on my skin. I like a more satin, more blended out. On the eyes, it doesn't look too bad, but once you start blending it, it like it, it really just glitters up. It's cute. You can look at yourself. No, 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 like, I'm gonna look at myself. <laughs> oh. Oh, I think it's glitter. It doesn't show, it doesn't show as much as I can. Can you just look at it's like hard. Yeah, but it's like yeah, glittery. So when I like, okay, oof. Look at something. Ooh. You actually can't see it from all my back. Yeah, you can't really, but then you also can't see a lot of things from back. But I think from the front you can definitely see. Okay, so. Ew. <laughs> okay. I saved the best. I'm so excited to eat after this, by the way. <laughs> I'm just thinking how great it's gonna be. After. Okay, okay, okay. No, no, I have to time. Just... Oh my! I'm gonna cry. Okay, so if you don't understand the excitement, it's because in a boxy charm box, there's a ColourPop palette. And I got Golden State of Mind, which 
I'm sorry, but that's a great title for a palette. <laughs> I, okay. I don't wanna, okay. I think this is gonna be great. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's look at this cute packaging first of all. It's like the rose gold. It's not pretty. Okay, these colors are, ooh, so, oh my god, these colors are right up my alley. Maybe except Pay the Piper? Piper? It's Piper. Yeah. Pay the Piper. The Piper? What's it Piper? called? The, like the Pied Piper. Because they're No. Is that an American thing? Uh, yeah. Okay. I don't feel as bad. <laughs> ooh. I'm like almost lost. Okay, this is pretty. I wonder if it's this is the actual palette itself, exactly like the outside packaging. I really like how reflective it is, like this yeah. is. Okay. And I'll open it. Okay, there's no mirror. Whoa. Okay. These shadows are all shimmery. Check this out. Every single one is a shimmer shadow. Ooh, let's do some swatches. Okay, you do some swatches on this side. Like, do a couple, do a couple of this. And I'm gonna do a couple of these, just cause we don't have enough fingertips. We got some swatches here. Okay, I don't know why I chose to do that. You see some of these colors. They're like bronzy. Yeah. I'm excited about this palette, but the only thing I'm not excited about is the fact that like they're all shimmers. So like mm. I, you cannot do a complete look with any of them, but I'm really excited about this color. What is that color called? Sparkler or uptight? Which one would it be? Like from back to head, heads or tails? No, no it's, uptight. That is uptight. Yeah, uptight. Oh, so it's like the other. Okay, I see. Yeah, I really like this. The color uptight. It's kind of like a like a red. It's a shimmery red. Really like that. It has a nice color. And then. Yeah, I mean, there's some nice, there's, there's some nice shades. I'm gonna play around with them, seeing what I can create. But that's really great that we got a colorful palette and press eyeshadows anyway. Because you know, I don't know if you know, but ColourPop does a lot of pop eyeshadows, not a lot of. Press. Oh yeah. That's a relatively new thing. That's really awesome. So let's just go over all the price for everything. So the Tart Glow is uh, a retail price of twenty nine dollars. Okay, so basically I paid twenty one. And that includes shipping. So already with that product, it's like the box. So $29. I don't think this is worth $29. So I would not buy this. Uh, ColourPop palette, uh, $26. I would definitely pay $26. I would, yeah. Even though it's like not, I would still pay $26. They're all shimmering. Okay, Dr. Brand, pours no more. Okay, $47. Nah, fam. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't pay. I mean, look how small this is. We haven't tried it, so we don't know if it's like, good. In proportion to my hand, that is worth forty-seven dollars. No, nope. but okay. Well, this is where my like skincare, the skincare me gal wants to say like, I have tried two other products by him, mm -hmm. and they're both really expensive, and they worked better than I would have even dreamed. Mm -hmm. Like the micro abrasion exfoliating thing is insane. Like it's. It's it like, your favorite? Yeah, that one's yeah, yeah, that wasn't my first favorite. That one's fifty-two dollars. So good. So I mean, it, I I do think it's gonna be good. Um, the brow gal, uh, twenty-two dollars. Why did I think it was gonna be more? Yes, I think that's a fair price. I would probably like twenty dollars is what I would pay for it. So that the brow gel is definitely that. I'm really happy, and it, it got. This seems darker now. I don't know, maybe because we put that eyeshadow, and then the high definition liquid lipstick. Um, twenty four dollars. I don't know. I didn't try it, but when I was applying it, it felt sticky. Yeah, it was sticky. It didn't like mattify or dry. And I don't. Was it supposed to? I don't think it's so. It's just a liquid lipstick, but it was it, sticky. So I don't think it was supposed to be matte. It, it was sticky, but also didn't feel like really moisturizing. Yeah. So I don't know. Definitely. The highs of this were definitely the brow gel, not too sure about the lipstick, the vacuum cleaner, and the eyeshadow palette. So, these three were mine. Top three. What were your top three? You pick, but be honest. 
probably the eyebrow thingy because like some of these colors are just way too sheer to show up like on my skin and then also i think these colors would look a lot better if you sprayed them like if you foil them on the eye mm -hmm. then i think they would show up close for you yeah and then you know haven't tried this so i don't know if it's actually you know but really good but, right but like it, this brand has a great reputation because you're always hearing about it so i think it's probably gonna be really well that's it this was the monthly boxy charm unboxing got an empty box that i almost hit myself with <laughs> sorry my life but hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope it was informative fun thanks for watching catch you on the flip side peace, peace. Yay, that's a wrap, honey. Why is it in, why is it in red? What does that mean? Oh, it means it's running out of, um. Uh, I'm so hungry.